Fashion Sewing Blog TV. I'm Colleen G. Lee and in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to identify the right and wrong side of your fashion fabric. Sometimes it's difficult to tell the wrong and right side of your fabric as in this case here both sides look very similar. It's very important that you choose the right side you want to work with when you come to lay your sewing patterns. Sometimes it's easier you have a bright side and a dull side and this will be the wrong side. You also have another clue which is going to be the selvage. On the selvage you find tiny holes and on the right side of your fabric the holes will be raised and on the wrong side it will feel flatter and smoother. On this fabric it's hard to tell by the selvage which is going to be the wrong and right side. This is more about touch so touching the fabric it feels smoother on this side and on the underside it feels a lot well not a lot a little bit more hairier so I would choose this as my wrong side. Like the last example the selvage isn't going to be of any help so just by looking this side looks more luxurious and this side looks dull. Another clue will be the manufacturer's marking which is usually done on the right side of your fabric. Going back to my first fabric I actually know this is the right side of my fabric and this is the wrong and it's a textured fabric and you can usually tell by touch again it feels a lot more raised than it does on the wrong side but I am going to be choosing the wrong side to use because I like the darker tones to the fabric as opposed to the right side. The important tip to remember here is that whenever you come across a situation where you find it difficult to make the choice which is the right and wrong side, make the choice of which side you want to work with and then when you come to lay your pattern pieces out, always mark every single piece the wrong side. Don't forget to subscribe to Fashion Zone Blog TV for free weekly video tutorials and if you have any comments or queries, please put them in the comment box below and I will see you next time.